It is time for an X Factor Choice Pack, boys. Yo, what's going on, Leaf Nation? It's Leaf back again, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we are back uh, with a X Factor Choice Pack. So, uh, we're going to open up one of those choice packs, and we're also going to show you guys what my team's looking like as of now. So, before we open up the pack, let me show you what this team is looking like. I I'm a fan of it. It could definitely be better, but I really do enjoy it. So, my first line being Jack Eichel, Austin Matthews, and Connor McDavid. Obviously, if we can pull X Factor Connor McDavid, uh, that would be absolutely huge because uh, we have his base and we could just upgrade him uh, straight away. So, uh, first line's looking pretty good. Our second line, we got 90 overall uh, Alexander Ovechkin, 87 overall Matt Sundin, and the Turcotte that we did end up getting from our uh, 22 and under uh, choice or pack that you get a free one from. So, uh, we could upgrade them to a 92, but I'm going to wait for the collectible sake because I'm going to wait for next week. I have a feeling one of my Leaf boys might get one, like Rasmus Sandin possibly. So if he gets one, I would definitely want to make him. Uh, regardless, third line is looking like 87 overall David Pasternak. We could get him up to an 88 right now, but we're holding off on that. We got Ryan Kessler and Evgeny Malkin. Uh, and then we got Shifley who can get up to an 87, but we're holding off on that as well. Chris Draper and Taylor Hall. So you guys are probably wondering, why did you take Draper, not Pekka? Just for the synergy wise, we, we, we took Draper. Um, on D here, we got Adam Foote and Ulf Samuelson. This pairing is absolutely insane. Two Unreal cards. If you guys are going to do collections, uh, get through uh, the Metro and whatever the Avs is. I'm so bad with, with Divisions. Um, and then our second pairing being Victor Hedman and Halloween Rivals Kale McCarr. I uh, haven't been a fan of Hedman as of late, but it is a decent card. And Kale McCarr is absolutely unreal. And then this pairing ain't the greatest. We have Dougie Hamilton and Jakob Slavin. Um, I want to make uh, Darlene because he would fit synergy-wise. But like I said, I'm waiting to see if my boy Rasmus Sandin gets one next week. And then in there, we got Robin Lehner and Joachim Eriksson. And then looking at our synergies, we do have Bombarded activated. We do have Fly the Zone activated. Magician, Heart the Soul, uh, Heart and Soul. And then uh, eventually, we'll have Protector activated once we get uh, Tur caught up to a 92. Because once he gets up to a 92, we unlock Protector there. So uh, eventually, we will get him up to a 92. Again, we're waiting to see if Rasmus Sandin gets one next week so without further ado boys let's uh let's hop into it let's open up this x-factor choice pack um who are we looking for i mean the obvious good ones that we don't have mcdavid is number one priority uh we got mckinnon would be absolutely insane uh crosby um am i missing anyone else i i, I, I probably but uh those are the, th the three that i really want being mcdavid mckinnon or uh crosby okay so here it is boys we're hoping for something good. One of those three would be great. One out of five choice here. Come on, EA. Bless us here. We need that McDavid here. All right. Here we go. First card. Sean Couturier. Ain't great. Second card. John Carlson. Not bad. We could probably use him on D. But again, we're, we're looking for those high rated cards. What's the synergies? I don't even think he'd make the. John Carlson is an option if we do want to go that route. But again, we're hoping for McDavid in one of these. Austin Matthews, we already have. That's one of the top dogs, though. Leon Dreisaitl, we already have as well. Just chilling in our collection. And last card, Matthew Barzell. Oh, my. We got two 77s, but I have them both, man. That one hurts the soul. I really, really, really did want um, our boy uh, McDavid. Katuria wouldn't be a bad shout because we can get him up. No, only an 86. Maybe not Couturier, dude. I, I think we're going to go John Carlson, boys, in all honesty, man. To go Barzell, I don't think it really makes sense. I might, like, my forwards are pretty stacked. I did say I need better defense. We can throw in John Carlson instead of Dougie Hamilton for the time being. So John Carlson it is, boys. I, I'm honestly so sad we didn't pull McDavid or McKinnon or Crosby, in all honesty. It hurts. It hurts a little bit. So we were able to upgrade John Carlson up to an 83. I, I'm just short of his base card. His base card is going for around 10k. So eventually we'll make some uh, 5k coins and get him up to his 85. And then uh, we need four power up collectibles, which I should be able to make. So we can get him up to an 86 or an 87 here. Uh, it's a good looking card, man. Uh, it does kind of suck that he doesn't really have synergies that I use. Uh, sucks that we didn't get McDavid, but it's fine. The team's still looking good. The defense did get better, which is great. Um, but yeah, that is it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed my team. If you guys have any suggestions what I should do different for my team, uh, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, 
honestly, uh, the only big thing I want to do is get X Factor McDavid, and then I'm kind of just chilling. But when the time comes, the time comes, boys. But like I said, that is it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to drop a like on it. If you guys are new around here, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. Uh, but guys, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.